What's up guys, it's your boys Wolky back with another Funko Pop video and obviously from the thumbnail you guys can see three Funkos we're going to be taking a look at two from She-Hulk and one from the Black Panther Wakanda Forever. I'm definitely excited because I didn't think they were going to post a video or a uh, Funko Pop for the, the Wakanda Forever until the movie took place to kind of like steer away from the, the leaks and the, and the sneak, speak, or sneak peeks as you will. But obviously, we already know with the She-Hulk ones, with the She-Hulk uh, series finally under wraps, which, again, I'll post the links in the description of my review on it. I'm a little bummed out. So, though we have not gotten a uh, Daredevil red and yellow version of um, Funko Pop version, which I'm kind of a little shocked about, but we're going to be taking a look at two of the She-Hulk Funko Pops for you guys to add to your collection. So, without further ado, grab a chair. Grab some popcorn as we take a look at these three Funko Pops that you need for your Funko collection as soon as possible. Let's take, take a look. If you guys are new to my channel, if you guys are returning and have not subscribed yet, make sure you guys subscribe right now by hitting the red bar icon down the bottom right. Smack the bell icon next to it. So when I do post videos like this one, you'll get that little ring notification that I've posted a video. And then you guys can watch, comment, like, and share. And again, thank you so very much for the continued love and support you guys show on this channel every single day. I can't thank you guys enough. Keep doing what you guys are doing. And we'll continue to grow together. But that being said, you guys are wanting to talk about Funko Pops. And the three Funko Pops we're talking about is She-Hulk in two different versions. One in an elegant dress. And the other one in her super suit. Um, that well, I can't remember what that woman says in The Incredibles. No capes! That's all she says. But... And then we're going to be taking a look at also the Black Panther. We still don't know. There's been rumors that it's possibly the Black Panther's old girlfriend, Nakia. Or it's Black Panther's sister, Shiri. I think I still think it's Shiri because her the helmet looks a lot like the way that she would do her like kind of like war paint or her blasters and stuff like that. But then there's also rumors that there's going to be more than one Black Panther, which would be dope as crap. But obviously, we still don't know who the actual Black Panther is. Shiri, Nakia, Okoye. I don't think it's Okoye. Okoye looks bad. As, as she is so let's just leave it at that but with that being said let's take a look at the she hulk funko pops first and then we'll get into the black panther but let's take a look at the website which is a website i use all the time it's pop in the box or pop in a box i'm not being sponsored by anyway it's a great website i've purchased from them for i think it's been like three or four years now maybe three just yeah three and i've never had a damaged pop I've never had any problems with any of my pops coming in on time. Great website. Link is down in the description for you guys to click on these. Pre-order, purchase, whatever have you. There's tons of Funko on here. So without being said, let's take a look. You guys can see right here, this is going to be the Attorney at Law Funko Pop. Um, She-Hulk in her normal super suit. Um, you guys can see on the, the, the top left there. It is expected to come out in the new year of 2023. It is $11.99. I still can't believe when I started collecting Funko Pops, they were normally $8.99, and now they're up to $11.99. Ridiculous. But you guys can see right here, I actually am digging the color green where it's actually not like a blah kind of green. It's more of a, I don't know, a neonish glow kind of green. Um, I don't know. This green is kind of growing on me. But I definitely have already pre-ordered this um, Funko Pop. I know there's a lot of people out there that are like, oh my gosh, She-Hulk sucked. She-Hulk was terrible. It wasn't terrible, but it wasn't good. And I, I posted my uh, review about this TV series down in the link in the description. So check out that video. I'm not going to get into it much on this Funko Pop video, but... I, I still want to add to my collection of different series that I've had. I've got Moon Knight. I got Loki. I got all the series that have come out. The What If. I'm going to keep, keep continuing these collections until I'm either dead or Funko decides to go under and they don't make any Funko Pops. So I'm going to continue as much as the next Funko fan is going to be uh, collecting and pre-ordering these. So moving on. Um, the next one, I don't see myself getting this one, but you guys can see this is the She-Hulk Gala dress. Um, it's a dress, okay? It's She-Hulk and a dress. I don't see myself buying this one. It does say glitter. I think that's what it said. Yep, it says glitter. I'm not really caring about glitter. Um, there are the other Funko Pops that we definitely talked about not too long ago, which was Wong, which I have pre-ordered already. I pre-ordered the Abomination. Um, I wish, again, in the, the TV series, we saw more of... Um, 
Abomination, but I wanted to get the Funko Pop version. Um, you guys can see Titania. You can see normal Jennifer. Uh, uh, you can see normal Jennifer Funko. Sorry. Um, and then obviously you guys can see Hulk, um, vaulted She Hulk. But I I have the vaulted or this um, Hulk Funko Pop, which it's kind of shocking because it wasn't his suit wasn't that blue. I'm kind of wondering why they made it like that, but. And then you guys can see uh, the Marvel attorney at law, Nikki, her friend, um, obviously right there. I only got in certain ones. I didn't buy every single one. But with that being said, moving on to the next one, which is going to be Black Panther. Black Panther is still not in this section. Right there. There he is, finally. Um, Black Panther, you guys can see right here from the Wakanda Forever that's getting ready to debut in November. I'm so pumped. Um, I'm a little sad because obviously I want to chat, chat with Bozeman, but... We all know that he had passed on, um, but I'm, I've already pre-ordered this Funko Pop. I can't wait to add to my collection. Um, but you guys can see right here, the Black Panther Wakanda Forever, $11.99. Comes out right before the new year, um, which I'm glad we don't have to wait too long. The only thing that's really different to me is actually looking at this picture. You guys can see right here. So if you look at this picture, you guys can see a necklace that normally the Black Panther would wear. But if you actually look at the photos of the Black Panther, which I'll pop up here for you, you can see the necklace a little bit, but it's not extravagant like it would normally be on like Killmonger or this Black Panther or the other Black Panthers that we've seen. Um, but it just doesn't look the same. Obviously, it could be because it's a Funko Pop version. It's different. But again, looking at this Funko Pop, it looks different than said image of the actual new black panther could i be looking into this a little bit too much possibly but again this funko pop itself is definitely amazing as it is i love the gold i love the silver it actually will glow like uh chadwick boseman's black panther of the purple so i'm hoping they will make a funko pop like this kind of like this one that i just got i love the funko pop um it's a little harder to see the black and white, but then with the purple. I'm hoping they do that with this one where we get a different variant version of it where it's actually, it looks like this one, but it's got the gold and the silver. That's gonna look super tight. And I, I can't wait to see what more Black Panther Funko Pops we will get, including Ironheart. So excited. But with that being said, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys are going to be getting any of these Funko Pops, comment down below. And also, don't forget to hit that like button. That like button helps out immensely. It's free. So why not hit the like button? And of course, don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next video. So keep it real. Keep it safe. And as always, keep nerding on. And we'll see you guys next time. Peace.